Hi guys, this is Orchid. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own napkin rings on the cheap. I'll be using items you can pick up at say any craft store. I'm using glitter cardstock paper. That's the pink paper you see there and the other two are glitter foam paper. Now I also picked up some decorative elements that I'm going to be adding to the um, paper. My first step is to cut them into the napkin ring sizes and I generally cut them one and a half by five and a half inches. It's going to depend on the size of your napkin rings or your taste, whether you want them to be very wide or very slim. Now once I do that, my next step is to add the decorative elements. I picked up these little flowers from the craft store as well. They have glue on the back so they stick securely to the glitter paper. As you see, they're not going anywhere at all. Next, I'm going to simply wrap that around the napkins. And since this is the glitter cardstock, I'm going to have to glue that with my trusty glue gun. And that's basically it, guys. With the foam paper, it is already sticky, so you don't need to use your glue gun for that. And I generally get as many as 20 out of the 12 by 12 sheets. Not bad guys. Not bad at all. Please continue watching guys. I'll be making a few more using different decorative elements. Gold has made such a huge comeback, so I'm doing a gold version. There is no way I could have done this project without doing something in gold. And I'm adding sequins just to give it the extra oomph. Now we're not giving up on silver. Silver will always be in for me. So I'm using sequins I got from the Dollar Tree to give you the silver version of the gold that I just showed you. For this one I'm using glitter ribbon that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. This is actually from last year but they generally have them every year. Then I'm adding a strip of the glitter foam on top and of course here comes the bling Dollar Tree style. Can't go without the bling. Now for this one I use the pink glitter foam paper and I wrap a strip of ribbon around that then glue the sequins on top. I'm showing you the silver version as well. For this one I use embossed paper wrapped with a ribbon then glued a sequin button on top.
I hope you guys are inspired by this. It's not a very costly craft and it looks good. I mean, you get a lot of bang for your buck here. Um, the cardstock and the glitter foam sheets are like $1.99, $1.50 per sheet. And like I mentioned earlier, you can get up to 20 out of it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And if you like what you see, subscribe. Bye now.